Hello and welcome to the lesson. A quick update of the new Microsoft .NET Core 6 Preview 7. This is a new feature that you can use in .NET 6. When you create a new console application, you will see only one line of code. So you normally expect to see this when you create a new console application. You expect to see the using statements, the namespace, the program class and a uh, entry point, which is the static void main. But Microsoft simplified this. So if we delete everything and we let only one line of code, Microsoft uses some defaults. So as you see here, the actual namespace depends on the project name. The using statements depends on the project type. If it is a console application, it will have some using statements. And if it is a web API application, it will have the web API application using statements. Microsoft also removed the public class program and the public static void main because every application has only one entry point. So after we remove all this code, we have these defaults and every code you write in this program.cs file is run as it if it was written into the public static void main. Now, if you like the newer approach or the other approach, both approaches represent the same program. Both are valid with C Sharp 10. When you use the newer version, you only need to write the body of the main method. Everything else has some predetermined defaults. Let's quickly go to the Microsoft website. Here you can see the both new forms of writing the program.cs side by side. So the new way is focused on what code you type everything else is hidden and for console applications the following directives are implicitly included in every source file in the application so we have the link http json and collections generic usings now i'm gonna demonstrate this to you we will work on a project later in this course. So I will show you how you can convert an existing project to this style of writing the main method. This is a block of code that we are gonna use in the following lessons. And this block is using the old style. We have a using statement, we have a namespace, a class and the static void main. If we delete everything here and we let only this line of code, this line of code it will execute in the main method. But as you see here, we have no using statement that contains the execution logic. We can add one by clicking on the first using here, Visual Studio help us. And now everything works and we only have two lines of code in the program.cs and we can run the application. I will record the following chapter using the old way of declaring a main method this way to be more exactly but now you know the both ways so feel free to use the whatever mode you want both will do the same thing see you in my next lessons take care